Hey guys, Patrice here with another haul. Um, this time we're doing an Ella After. This is her sale. She had a big uh, spring cleaning sale. So all this stuff is older stock from 2020. Uh, some of it could be the beginning of 2020, um, but it was 60% off. And I do have the regular prices and the sale prices. Um, obviously not everything, but honestly, from what I bought could fit in this box. So I will have some coming in the next month or so with my next order. So anyways, I hadn't even, oh, sorry guys. I haven't even opened it. This is packed to the brim. So we will get right into it. So, um, sorry for the tissues, whatever you hear. I just haven't, yeah, so. Anyway, starting off, we have uh, a tart bag of Dollhouse Chi, which is relaxing spa-like florals with a touch of fruit and vanilla. That's what that looks like. So this is regular. The tarts were regular, six seventy-five Canadian, and they were on for two seventy. This is really nice. This is just like you said. A, she said a a spa-like. It's very clean, very spa, very not like laundry clean, but just very clean. All right, this is the girl who drank the moon uh, tart and a lavender marshmallow and creamy zucchini bread. That's what that looks like. And again, regular 675 on for 270. This is really nice. You do get that lavender marshmallow, but it's really tamed down by her, the creamy zucchini. I really like her creamy zucchini. So um, we got quite a few scent shots here. Um, I do believe I got four. Oh yeah, right here. So I got four of the Girls Club. You guys have seen me haul this before. This is Pink Sugar American Cream and Dollhouse Chi, which I got regular. That so her regular scent shots are six seventy five, and this they're on for a dollar ten uh, for two ounces. Um, and that's Canadian. So even if people from the States bought it, you get still another like 30% off on top of that. So they were getting under two ounces for under a dollar, which is crazy. This is, I love this. One of my favorite scents from her. You can smell the pink sugar. You can smell American cream. You mix it with that dollhouse cheese. It's amazing. So I got two corduroys which is marshmallow, blue cedar wood, eucalyptus, and lavender. I didn't buy this um, when she first released this. This is part of her to the moon, black, ba moon and back collection. Mm, you get that um, blue cedar wood and a little bit of lavender. And you get that marshmallow. I really like this really nice, like kind of just calming bedroom scent. So um, I got two... If you give a mouse a cookie, that one's labeled twice for some reason. Anyways, um, I don't know what happened there. Sorry. It was just really confusing. It's labeled one way and then labeled the other. Um, this is lavender marshmallow and bed night snacks. Bed night snacks is like zucchini and sugar cookies. This is, I like this. This is a very bakery um, lavender. It's still calming. It's not out there, but it's definitely more like bakery lavender. So then the girl I drank the moon, the girl who drank the moon, they were from the same collection. So I got one backyard bonfires, which is um, blackberry, merlot, cedarwood, tobacco, and patchouli. I do believe it's called, the oil is called by the campfire. That's just a single oil. And this one I'm okay with. Um, it's not my, uh, super favorite, but I did not mind that when I was warming. So I wanted to pick up another one when it was on sale. <sighs> Sorry guys, the things are all over. I got two. Guess how much I love you, which is lavender comfy cozy. Comfy cozy is L after's version of patchouli linen. I love her comfy cozy. I really do. Um, she has another one. I don't think she sent any from um, another order I made, which is Sadis House. And that is 
toasted marshmallow, I believe. And patchouli linen is one of my favorite blends. So anyways, I really like that. Uh, I got two Mr. Cratchit, which is fluffy shaving cream and flannel sheets. And I love this. I should have got more. Definitely get equal parts flannel sheets and shaving cream. Very bedroom, very nice bathroom scent. And these ones are, are only poured, I don't know if you guys can see that, in November. And she put these on sale too, which is crazy to me. So just going to haul the rest of these scent shots that I can see out. And uh, yeah, then we'll... So... Okay, I got one Apple Mango Tango, which uh, our favorite scent from the popular lane, Gain Detergent. And yeah, it just smells like Apple Mango Tango. I really like it. It's not my favorite laundry blend, but it's a really good one. So this is Llama Llama, which is vanilla, wintergreen, and peppermint. This one's whew, very peppermint, very, very peppermint, very I can't express that enough. Very peppermint. I like that for blending. Um, I'm not going to warm that on its own. It, yeah. Anyways, um, the next one I have is two Radiant Red Maples. Uh, ripe pear, vanilla bean, toasted maple wood and amber. And it smells like the dupe from Bath and Body Work. You definitely get like the maple wood scent. I really like that one. It's not overly strong, I don't find, but I figured for $1.10 for two ounces, I can't go wrong. This, I got two of Fezziwig, which is sparkling pear, champagne, and mac apple. Oh, it's so good. I love fizzy scents, especially mixed with mac apple. Love that one. I think I might have more in there too. And then I got for Ella Bean's Ween, which is probably one of my number one blends from her, which is Sweet Berries on Freshly Washed Blankets. It's so good. It's so good. I actually have it in my melting basket right now. Oh, it just, you can smell that berry, but you get that cleanness from the laundry. Oh, it smells so good. If you guys haven't tried anything from her, I highly recommend trying this one from her if you see it. So good. Okay, I got some clams here. So I got two clams of Ella Bean Queen. I don't need to go back over them. Just have to smell it. I've got a clam of Bah Humbug, which is Twisted Peppermint, uh, Serendipity, and Vanilla Ice Cream. So good. I definitely get that. You get all of it. You get 100% all of it. Um, serendipity, you get that creaminess from the vanilla ice cream and you get the twisted peppermint. This is a peppermint I can get behind 100%. I don't have very many clams if you've ever seen. Um, but yeah, so, um, I have a clam of Fezziwig and then I have a clam of autumn treats, which is just juicy pear on glaze and cupcakes at Tiffany's. Um, pear's not my favorite scent note, um, especially this, uh, pear on glaze. She has it in another blend for the Grinch, but it's not bad mixed with that Cupcakes and Tiffany, so. All right, see what else we got. It was a big order, guys, and like I said, it didn't all fit into this box. I have some coming in the next one, so. Um... I have Meg Witch, and that is Black Sea Barbershop, 18, 1920s, and yeah, sorry, Meg Witch, Black Sea and Barbershop, 1920s. This one, yeah, it's nice. It's not a super favorite for me, but I do like it, and I figured for 270 why not? Uh, the next one is Honolulu Sun. It's in her solo snaps. Uh, this is melon, island, coconut, palm leaves. Um, 
I actually just was going to buy some of this anyways before I went into the sale. I had put this in my bathroom and it blew me out of the bathroom. So, mm, yeah, it's really good. You definitely get that coconut and a little bit of palm leaves. Really good. Next one is a new one, actually, that I've never tried. It's Miss, Miss Havensham's Wedding Dress. Amber Musk, Worn Cedar, and Tattered Lace. I've never smelled this one. So I figured for the sale, I might as well... pretty light you do, you get that um, like tattered lace scent it's a very um, if you, I walked into an older house that's what I smell it's not bad I don't know if I would repurchase it but it, I'm glad I tried it on sale um, sorry for the noise okay so next Oh, and I didn't tell you guys, her clams were regular $6.50 and I got them for $2.60. So, uh, and the last kind of size I got is her 7 ounce tarts, the big ones, and they are regular $13.75 and I got them for, sorry, I wrote it down, $5.40. It's a lot of wax for $5.40. So this is Saturday morning cartoon, strawberry cereal, marshmallows and sugar milk. It's so good on cold. I don't like it at all, to be honest with you. I had a smaller bag of this and I really get like a strawberry sugar milk and that's that that's almost like stomach curdling to me, that sugar milk. But on warm, it's so nice. I had to buy more. So the next is Fright Night, Leaves, Marshmallow Fireside, Caramel Pumpkin Dreams, another big bag. It's so good. Um, it, you get the spice from the Caramel Pumpkin Dream, but you definitely get the leaves and a little bit of the marshmallow. It's like a pumpkin pie outside. It's really nice. The next is Daisy Dukes, uh, Frosted Grahams, Angel Food Cake, and Pink Sugar. Another large bag. This one's really good. You definitely get that Frosted Grahams. It is like kind of like uh, the Frosted Sugar Cookie. Animal cookies, what I've never smelled that, but it, this is what it would I would think that it smelled like mixed with pink sugar. So, okay, another big bag of chai before guys, cardamom, cumin, star anise, honey, and frothy milk. Mmm. It just smells like a chai. It's just, you get that frothy milk, you get the spices and stuff. It's so good. I didn't think I'd like that one. And then when I smelt it blended with Weekend at Little Hawk, she does, I get it's called. It's um, uh, like a granola pear kind of thing. It's so good. I had to buy some. So this is Caffeine Before Hygiene, which is sugar cookies and lattes. It's just a regular tart. Oh, so good. Definitely a coffee sugar cookie. And this is Noise, 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 which is watermelon, bubblicious, and blonde moments. Mm. Love blonde moments. I love it. I just got into blonde moments this year, and it's so good. Okay, so this is another girls club. I got tired of it. Um, as you guys can tell, some of these labels are a little, little this, I, you might not be able to see it, but they are a little, maybe if I put them, see how this one is a little bit more discolored, but it's from almost a year ago, but it, it's still her stuff I'm melting from a year ago and it performs well. So this is Mall Madness, Rich Espresso, Sweet Dough and Cream Cheese Frosting. Yep, I get the espresso and I get the kind of doughish scent. It's really good. And the next is luxury vanilla, which is beautiful vanilla and sweet sweet cookies. And that's just what it smells like. It smells like a very creamy vanilla cookie. Oh, I got another Bah Humbug clam, I guess. Um, next 
Texas Summers in the Light. And this is Pink Sugar and Beechwood. Mm, oh, you get that peach, that pink sugar, but you get that really nice beech wood too. It's the next is Who's a Snooze, which is actually a new one for me, and it's Comfy Cozy and Rosewood. And that Comfy Cozy was the patchouli linen. So you definitely get that rosewood more than the Comfy Cozy. This probably isn't my favorite Comfy Cozy blend she did. It's very winterish. Um, as like sat status house is very like every time of year. Um, this one is very fall or winterish. All right, guys, we're coming to the last little bit here. Um, next one is summer camp treats, orange chiffon, lemon marshmallow, and rice krispies. I don't know why my face did that. It's so good. It's the orange lemon bakery. It's really good. The next is soak up the sun, which is citrus, sweet cherry, vanilla cake pops, and cotton candy. Definitely get that cherry. So if you don't like cherry, I wouldn't get this one. And you get the little bit of cotton candy. So, but it's very, very cherry heavy. And I've just showed my appreciation for cherry. The next is the last is a large bag of Rocky Point treats, sweet bear, mixed berries, vanilla ice cream, and sugar waffle cone. And this one's really good. I just recently melted this one, and it's so good. You definitely, it smells like a berry uh, ice cream. So, anyways, guys, that is my huge Ella after sale haul. Again, um, I couldn't pass up a good sale. You guys know if you watched me how much I love Ella after. Um, and it being on sale is even better. So I have more sale to come. Um, at some point, I told her just to hold it and combine it with my next order. Um, I have another L after pre-order coming next week. I have hopefully Brita's rainbow melts. Um, uh, L three. And I think that might be it. I got another like five orders coming. So anyways, guys, I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.